Yo, what up, guys? Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome back to a brand new dude. We got Paul Miller to life before and after. Paul, drop a sick riff, man, for the fam. What? Dude, I was not expecting that. Well, you can play guitar and piano. Yeah, man, a little bit. What's up, bro? <laughs> so it is 4:20 today, April 20th. Figured it'd be a great day, man, to talk about this topic. A lot of it's a hot topic out there. 65%? No, for real though. 65% of Americans are for approval. Legalization. Yeah, dude. 65%, man. Weed. Injecting marijuanas in the military. Active duty and reserves. Can you inject? Can you inhale? And when I was in England, I experimented with marijuana a time or two, and I didn't like it. And didn't inhale, and never tried it again. I did not inhale. One of my Marines came up like, uh... Are oh, we gonna have a piss test today? <laughs> and it usually came down to okay, they were doing not just weed, but actually cocaine or some shit over the weekend. Oh shit! But yeah, guys, I just wanted to talk about you know active duty. You cannot smoke, oh. cannot partake, cannot inhale in the reserves. So we got Paul that's potentially going reserves because um, he was active duty and now he might go reserves. I was in the reserves for a year. They do drug test you in the reserves. <laughs> they do, man. So don't risk that shit, man, in the reserves because uh, you'll get. Now, inactive reserves, the IRR, you're done. I've never heard anybody getting drug tested in the IRR. Have you? No, I've never heard anybody getting drug tested on the IRR. I've never heard of anybody getting drug tested on the GI Bill. Hey, double check, Davis. Davis? Yeah. Yeah, no, yeah, I, I got that guy. See, I've been on the GI Bill almost three years here at university with these mother truckers. Never heard of a drug test for GI Bill students. Never heard of anything for inactive ready reserve. Oh, uh, they but said we're having one today, actually. They're gonna come in here and they're gonna... No, oh, shit. <laughs> now, now, I have ran into people when I was active duty that did smoke during their leave periods. You know, you hear of it. And uh, that's just really fucking risky because it's a zero tolerance policy. If you get caught, I know some people got very fortunate and didn't get dishonorable discharge, like one or two people, but everyone else that I've heard of, you're getting dishonorable, you're going bye-bye, you ain't getting no bennies. Bennies are huge, you need those, <laughs> we need those bennies, man. <laughs> About uh, how many people did you see get taken out for it in your time? Well, there's a few people. A man. few? Yeah. Not, well, so, not, so much, not so much the marijuana, but more like, like E. Oh, like spice, worse other things. Stuff like that, yeah. Spice. Yeah, yeah, people will go to like these festivals, right, that are active yeah. duty, and they'll pop, you know, some E and some X and some J. It's just not <laughs> worth it. Yeah, no, I was telling you, it's not worth it, man. Don't risk the bennies for the biscuits. Yeah, it's definitely not worth it. Just, I mean, it's so easy to stay clean and yeah, sober yeah. and like yeah. whatever, but it's really easy to get effed over and, and get in trouble. Yeah. I just don't, it's not, it ain't worth it. All right, you heard it from Papa Fern from the Corman. <laughs> Corman. I knew people personally that got kicked out of the military for spice. Spice, oh, yeah. man. Spice was popping off when I was in 2010 and 2014. It was popping off. And people, uh, I don't know if they can drug test it now, because it wasn't tested, but it was still banned by the military. Even though it wasn't able to be tested, you still couldn't use Spice. So people in the barracks, this one kid, he was uh, admin personnel. He got caught with spice, his roommate told on him, and he turned in like five other people and they got, oh, yeah, you know shit. how that happens, right? <laughs> you hear in the military, you hear like 20 sailors kicked out in the so-and-so Virginia barracks. Yeah. It's like just the fucking, the NCIS <laughs> gets. Like, I'm taking everybody yeah. down with me. <laughs> just do your time, stay away from that shit when you're active duty. And then once you get out, man, inhale all the marijuana as you want. And I didn't like it and didn't inhale and never tried it again. All right guys, I'll see you very soon. Videos every day on the channel, Military Life Before and After. Hope you enjoyed this. We'll see you from Paul, from David, from the Kyle Lutheran uh, area. Make sure you check out our Facebook, support the uni. If you want to support the channel, I'll have all my shit below. Paul, let's get a nice outro riff. <laughs> Go on. Yeah, Alright, let's get a retry. Oh, retry. Outro with Paul. <laughs> Damn it. Okay. Fuck it, Paul. Fuck it. One more time, Paul. That's it. Damn, <laughs> that was good, bro.
Props right here. Don't let me hang it. Good shit.